We're here with Mark Clifford after after today's dramatic comeback at Sheffield, winning 3-2. The first hour wasn't the best, which I'm sure must have been frustrating. But what did you say to the lads uh, just after the hour mark, which just completely changed the game? I think first and foremost, I think to say the first hour wasn't the best is a bit unfair. We're away from home, a very well, a very well run, established football club in Sheffield FC. Um, and I thought, for certainly for the first half, I, I thought we were magnificent. We stayed in the game. Sheffield are a very good side, and we had to really fight just to come in um, at that 0-0 at half time. Um, the two goals that we've given away uh, for the first one, it's a yard out. Don't know what the linesman's thinking of. You know, their bench looking around laughing, and it's it, for me, it's not funny. We keep getting these poor officials, and I think it's time. You know, they were looked at because you know he's not even looking where the ball's coming from, looking where it's going. And that's poor. But overall, you know, to go back to your first comment. Um, you know, it weren't, weren't great. Um, listen, we've got no divine right to come to football grounds and dominate football matches. We have to work hard for it, and I thought we did that. Thomas Fielding came on and had an absolute blinder. What did you think of his performance? You've just said it. Nothing, nothing more to say. Uh, I toyed with the idea of starting him. Um, for you know, let him have a look at the game. Let's see how the game goes, and let's let's introduce him to it. And put him on the pitch and he introduced himself to this league. I think ultimately, you know, the boys got serious quality. You know, Mansfield have been grateful enough to, to let us to let us use him for, for a month or so. Um, and you know the boys got a bright future. He's, he's been very, very good for us today and, and got us out got us out of a hole. Um, so Messiah McDonald's first game uh, sorry. Messiah McDonald's first start today. What did you think um, when you brought him in? Is he anything particular you wanted to do? Uh, or is it just one of those things where we need more depth in the team and um, just need more competition going forward? I think it's all of those. I think we need more competition, we need a little bit more strength up top. We've got young Mason Lee, who's got, I hope to be patient and stays around. He, you know, a couple of weeks ago, showing what he can do. Um, and we've got now we've got the likes of um, Ken Bastos as well. We've got Rod. Uh, but ultimately, what I needed was someone else to go and work with Sean. And, and, and this league is about big, strong men. And sometimes you've got to batter teams a little bit and, and be in the fight. Um, before you can earn the right to play, and I thought those two today, um, Mass and Sean up top for us, were, were fantastic. They they got big lads at the back, and they they kept them at bay for large spells. Uh, finally, is there anything you'll be looking at possibly changing or keeping the same going into Saturday's FA Trophy game away to Bedworth Town? No, it, it will. Listen, we we will um, we'll train on uh, Tuesday, Thursday, uh, and we'll prepare like we do for every game. Uh, it, it'll be nice because it'll be a nice 4G pitch. Look, well, this is a great pitch today, in fairness, but. Nice 4G pitch, and we'll be going there because we want to adv advance in the trophy uh, and give our fans again something, something to shout for. You know, I've just been on the away supporters coach just before they left, and thanked them all. You know, they, they've been fantastic today, and even at 2-0 down, they've, they've stuck behind the team, and you know, we, we've given, we've given the reward for coming out here today, and you know, credit to the boys really.